I've managed to get Blender up and running on the Sun Microsystems V880Z and in this video I'm going to demonstrate this machine's performance when it comes to rendering test.blend and show you how it compares to the various SGI's that I've tested as well as the Apple computers. In order to do this I'm going to start off by opening up the terminal, starting bash. I'm going to open up my list of commands just to save some time. And I'm going to start the program. I'm going to open up test.blend, which I've got sitting on the desktop. Okay, and just for your information, this machine is fitted with six UltraSpark 3s running at 1.2 gigahertz. And this version of Blender will only allow me to allocate a maximum of eight threads. So I won't be able to allocate two threads per CPU as I have with the other machines. So I'm going to go ahead and open up eight threads. I'm going to start the rendering process. I'm also going to bring up the CPU performance monitor so that you can see the system performance. And right now all six of the UltraSpark 3s are running at full throttle. Also take note that towards the end of the rendering process you'll notice that the number of CPUs in use starts to drop off. Okay, you can see the number of CPUs in use is starting to drop off. And that frame rendered in 1 minute 48 seconds and 12 split seconds. So you can see this machine, even though it's fitted with 6 CPUs, it's not quite as fast as the SGI Tezro or the Power Mac G5 for that matter. I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching. 